Hey guys, today's video is brought to you by Donald Zombies, a survival simulation game that takes place in a post-apocalyptic world. I've never played a survival game before, so it got me really intrigued when they asked me to play this game. If you are like me and want to try something new, or you are just a fan of this genre, then feel free to download this game. It's completely free and it's available on both Android and iOS devices. So back to the game. In this new apocalyptic world, the places where those who survive are called the last territories. In this world, you'll have to try your best to survive and fight against zombies, radiation, monsters, and even other greedy humans. Okay, now that you know more or less about what's going on in this world, let's go to the gameplay. Just like many survival games, there are many things that need to be done in order to, well, survive and get stronger. First, you'll have your own base, and you'll want to collect materials and gears and store them there. As you keep collecting stuff, you'll be able to build your base and improve every part of it. Some of the most important things to build right away are essential things for survival, such as farm that will provide food new bags and boxes to store your items. This is probably the first and most important thing you should prioritize on crafting. A well and a campfire to boil the water. an anvil to create better weapons and gears, some fences to protect your base from zombies and mutants, and so many other things you can build to reinforce your base, but of course you won't be able to manage all of those things on your own, so another thing that you have to focus on is recruiting and saving many people to join you. Whenever you slay mutants or zombies, you will gain experience and level up as well, which then unlocks better gears that you will need in order to defeat stronger bosses. If you are feeling a bit lazy and want to take a small break, you can enable the auto mode function, but you will still need to keep an eye on your character, because eventually he will need to drink water and eat food. By the way, your weapons and tools lose durability every time you use them. You should only use your best weapons when they are truly necessary such as boss fights. At first, the game might seem quite simple and easy, but as you keep progressing through the main campaign, there are going to be a lot of challenging bosses that will require good gears and strategy in order to beat them. The game offers a lot of content and side quests for you to do, so you will never feel like completely stuck, which I think is quite important for a game.
the game does have an in-game cash store, the items will definitely help you go through the missions a lot faster. But it's not entirely necessary, it's really up to you how you want to play the game. Dawn of Zombies has tons of good reviews and according to multiple comments, it is one of the best survival simulation games on mobile, especially since free to play. If you are a fan of this genre or want to try something new, then feel free to download this game using my link in the description.